What's going on? How are you guys today? I'm excited because all of my years of research, making YouTube videos, personally experimenting, culminates to products like this. And we have two to discuss today, the digestive enzymes, as well as mastic gum, which I spoke about in depth yesterday in my H. pylori video. And you guys have seen me in just about every single day of eating, talk about enzymes and antimicrobials I'm taking. Well, today you're gonna find out what it has been. And I've wanted to do this sooner, but getting my hands on the Mastigum has been incredibly difficult. I reached out to an enzyme company that I was using, and I wasn't too happy with their product, but it worked and it was better than most other things on the market. And they said, oh, well, you're not a doctor, so uh, we can't sell you the product at a good price. And I was like, you know what? I'm gonna make my own enzyme supplement with what I want in it, and it's gonna be better than your junk. Uh, so let's get started with the Masticum because we did talk about it yesterday. And I have this available in 50 gram packs on organsupplements.com. Uh, these are the small tiers. And the way I take these is kind of like lazy. And if you guys haven't seen Masticum before, I mean, it's, it's really cool stuff. It's unique. It's like little tiny rocks essentially. And what you could do is you can grind them into a powder or like hammer them into a powder. You can you know, keep them in this bag, put them in a Ziploc bag, crush it into a powder with like a mallet or like take a spice grinder and blitz it up or do what I do and just take a little bit of my mouth, mash it up with my teeth and I swallow it down with some water. Now the powder is obviously better. You know, you would like crush it up, take a teaspoon of the powder, swig that down with some water and you want to do it relatively quickly in your mouth because if this sits in your mouth for like 20, 30 seconds, it'll actually become soft and you can chew it like a gum. And that's good because then you're gonna have like mastic saliva leaking into your stomach, which is great uh, for combating H. pylori, digestive issues. And I will say it's much harder to chew than regular gum. Now, some of you guys are like, Frank, how'd you get your jaw that big? Did you get jaw implants? I mean, it's much smaller now, but I think it was literally like this big. This stuff is like, chewing something really, really tough. I would say it's like five to 10 times harder to chew than regular gum, which is why you know, your jaw muscles will get so big. And, and the reason I stopped doing that is because I was getting headaches from the tension in my jaw muscles. It, it, was, it was that much jaw hypertrophy. Uh, so uh, I've tried making cookies with this and they tasted horrible. <laughs> so don't, just take this as a supplement, guys. Uh, it's about, $15 on organsupplements.com. And I mentioned that it's kind of expensive, you know, compared to what people are spending and with how much this has healed my stomach. I was taking so much of this at one point, I was probably spending five to $10 a day just on mastic gum. But for the most part, it shouldn't be more than a few dollars. And it's really the only effective antimicrobial, in my opinion, that can be taken on a consistent basis because it doesn't stress the liver. Like it's kind of, acting on its own. When you take oregano oil, when you take you know, dozens of dozens of different herbs, clove oil, really nasty stuff that's corrosive, it has to be processed by your liver. It's getting absorbed into the intestines, into the bloodstream. It's a lot of stress on the body, things like berberine. This stuff, it stays in your stomach, it acts as an antimicrobial, and it's excreted in the bowel movement. It's not a lot of stress at all. And it's why it's the only antimicrobial that I've continued to take. You know what I actually saw in a health food store once? They had honey with mastic in it. And I didn't buy it because I thought it was gonna taste pretty off. But th there's something to be said about certain herbs and spices and things like mastic being used in cooking to combat like high sugar, high carbohydrate foods as an antimicrobial. So check this out guys. And you get a nice little box like this. It's I think the lowest price online actually, I looked around. And, and for me, it's not about you know, making money on these products, it's more about getting you guys something that's high quality and hopefully in the future I can offer you guys even more things. So I made a video on enzymes quite a while ago now, maybe over a year ago, and I've explained all of them in depth. Like what are the protein digesting enzymes, carbohydrate fat digesting enzymes, why you need them, how to improve them in your body, and, and this is all of them. So everything you need to digest a balanced meal. So that means if you're carnivore, you guys are gonna have to wait a month or two. I will get 
like a pure protein digesting enzyme and a pure fat digesting enzyme and I'll sell it alongside this but you know you want to have steak rice some fiber a balanced amount of carbs fats and protein when you take this enzyme I mean could you take it on a carnivore diet yeah but it has proportions so it's not a crazy 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 amount of protein digesting enzymes which is what you would need on carnivore so in this we have the amylase which breaks down the starches we have the lipase which digests fats we have betaine hcl to increase the acidity of the stomach and then pepsin to break down the protein in the stomach into smaller components where the trypsin and the chymotrypsin can finish digesting the protein so we have everything carbohydrate fat and protein I was debating on putting ox bile in this and I didn't because I I think it's gonna taste really horrible whereas with this you can take it down just fine it doesn't actually taste like anything uh, so here I have a little bit of pineapple kefir that I made and I just take a heaping teaspoon and I mix it in I've done two teaspoons and you know that kinda is too much uh, the way you can gauge your enzyme intake is if you take too much you'll get diarrhea if it's just perfect you'll have normal bowel movements basically like ghost wipes like you don't have to wipe so I'll just drink this down with my kefir and it's kind of weird that I actually like the taste that it adds to the kefir so it's not something I mind at all and normally when you take a digestive enzyme supplement that's not powdered like this you have to wait for you know the capsules to break open it might not incorporate too well this is kind of instant and active although you know in the near future hopefully I'll have my own capsule machine and then maybe we'll make some capsule stuff for people that don't like powders but this is what we have for now so if you guys do order this on organ supplements it's gonna come in a blank pouch I don't have the labels ready yet and I have a limited amount I think this is gonna sell out in a week or two but hopefully I can get some more in stock as soon as possible so if you guys are having digestive issues if you're not absorbing nutrients if you have SIBO candida anything enzymes are an incredibly important component of what you're doing and the water kefir helps a lot if you don't have the water kefir it's obviously still gonna be really really good and way better than not taking anything what the water kefir really helps with is breaking down those carbohydrates and more importantly digesting the sugar so if you're like me and you're eating cookies the water kefir is really important uh, for making sure that the liver doesn't get too stressed by that sugar otherwise you know if you're not having water kefir you might just want to stick to the enzymes with a meal of like steak rice potatoes and cauliflower not too much sugar yeah I don't want to go too much in depth breaking down each of these individually and I think the product is really gonna speak for itself when you guys try it out I also have the magnesium oil available now on organ supplements and if you guys placed an order yesterday or if you like ordered magnesium in the past week that wasn't the new oil just send me an email say hey Frank I just placed an order but I want the magnesium oil now can you add it? I'll give you guys a discount on the shipping depending on what you ordered maybe I'll even send you some for free so definitely send me an email if it's those circumstances for you guys uh, so thanks for joining me today if you could please drop a like on the video Leave a comment down below, subscribe so that YouTube can unsubscribe you next week, and be sure to check that notification bell so they don't notify you of my videos. Therefore, you can go to frank defonocom to support me through all of my businesses, and as I've mentioned several times throughout this video, OregonSupplements.com for the mastic gum, we got the digestive enzymes, and the magnesium oil, everything is going to ship out by the end of this week, guys. Thanks again, and I'll see you tomorrow. Thank you.